collection of transcripts and notes from months of prisoner interrogation. The information stored on a military-grade laptop, kept in the main holding area downstairs. en route.
Yo, what's good? This your boy Lustful Power Man. Today I got another real quick build video for y'all. And in this video, I'll be bringing y'all my Walker and Harris LMG damage to armor build, man. But don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Let's get into the build. Okay, so on this build, I'm running the Gunner class. The main reason I'm running the Gunner class is killing an enemy grants 10% armor. Every third reload is 50% faster. Armor kits repair 100% armor and grant 30% bonus armor for 10 seconds. You also get the large pouch which gives you plus 50, 50 ammo. Alright, so let's check out the build. Alright, for my main gun, I'm running the new Reliable. This is a great LMG now. It's got 135.7k damage. We got 15 LMG damage, 12% damage to target out of cover. We got 6% damage to armor. And we got perfectly optimized. It grants plus 30% weapon handling. So with that 30% weapon handling, this gun has almost instant reloads, max stability, and it has great accuracy. I absolutely love this gun and I think y'all should try it out. But real quick, I'm gonna show y'all the mods. I got plus five crit hit chance, plus 20 rounds, plus five critical hit chance, and plus 10% accuracy. And as you can see, we don't have the uh, plus 50 rounds on this. It only takes the sturdy extended, the plus 20 rounds. All right, so let's check out the MG5. I'm using the infantry. It's hitting at 105.8. We got 15 LMG damage, 8% damage to target out of cover, and we got 6% damage to armor, and we got fast hands. Critical hits at a stack of 4% reload speed bonus. Max stack is 40. So you can get up to 40 stacks on that, and it almost makes your reload instant the more critical hits you land. Alright, so on the mask we're using two piece providence. We got 15 headshot damage, 10 critical hit chance. We got 15 weapon damage, 12 critical hit damage, 6 critical hit chance, and a 12 critical hit damage mod. We got the Walker and Harrison Co. chest piece. It grants 5 weapon damage, 5% damage to armor. We got 15 weapon damage, 6 critical hit chance, 10 headshot. We got a 12 critical hit damage mod, and we got glass cannon. All damage you deal is amplified by 25%. All damage you take is amplified by 50%. Alright, so we got a Walker, Harris, and Co. Uh, holster. It's got 15 weapon damage, 6 critical hit chance, 12 critical hit damage. We got the Overlord uh, Fox's Prayers. It gives you 10% rifle damage. We got 14.8 weapon damage, 8% damage to target out of cover, and 12% critical hit damage. And I'm rocking these for the multiplicative 8% damage to target out of cover. It will give you more damage than wearing Grupo here. So, you, you want that multiplicative damage. We got the Petrov Gloves, the Contractors. It gives you 10% uh, LMG damage, so you need this. We got 14.9 weapon damage, 8% damage to armor, and 12 critical hit damage. We got the Providence Backpack. It's got 15 weapon damage, 5.7 critical hit chance, 10.2 critical hit damage, 5.7 critical hit chance mod. And we got Vigilance. Increases total weapon damage by 25%, taking damage to disables this buff for 4 seconds. Alright, so on our skills, we run the Reviver Hive just in case we go down, and we're running the Fixer Drone for heals. Alright, so let's check out the stats real quick. We got 135k weapon damage, 47 PvP weapon damage, we got 59.4 critical hit chance, we got 127.2 critical hit damage, we got 110 headshot damage, and we have 19% armor damage. We got 104.7 all weapon damage bonus, and we have 40% light, light machine gun damage bonus. And that's the whole build, man. I think y'all should try out the new Reliable. It's a great gun. But don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. I appreciate you guys for coming through, man. Deuces.